My wife was working at her desk a few meters away from mine, as we did in, in lockdown. Um, and uh, one day she, she let out an exclamation said, I've won the Potemkin Prize, which is the major international prize for Alzheimer's research. So there was great celebration. And then about three days later, I was sitting working at my desk and I had an email pop up and said, you've won the King Faisal Prize. So I said, I've won the King Faisal Prize. So for the two of us, it was a, it was a glorious week and, uh, and it's made for a very happy year. One evening I was looking at my emails and I got an email <laughs> to tell me I'd won this prize. Uh, and of course, I, I, I was flabbergasted and shocked and thought, oh, this is really fantastic. I so, was so happy that uh, my work would have been rewarded by such a prestigious prize because the, the people who won the uh, King Faisal Prize in science over the years, uh, they're fantastic scientists who have done great work. I was on Twitter, just reading my Twitter feed, and um, I saw that somebody had sent me a message, and the message said, congratulations. I didn't know why, so I, I said, well, um, thank you. Um, uh, for what? <laughs> and the, the person replied um, that uh, with a link to a, a tweet from the Keen Faisal Prize Foundation that had just announced the winners. So I actually found out by reading Twitter. I'm sort of amazed that, uh, that in the end I was uh, chosen, but, uh, but I had no expectation or knowledge that, uh, that I was in the running. <laughs> I was reading emails in reverse chronological order. So the first emails were from some friends and colleagues who saw the news before I did. And uh, they said, congratulations, uh, hope you enjoy the trip. And I had no idea what trip they were referring to. <laughs> so then I went through several hours of emails back to about three or four o'clock in the afternoon. And then I saw the official email from the King Faisal Foundation saying congratulations, you have uh, uh, received the 2023 King Faisal Prize in Medicine. I'm uh, honored and delighted that the King Faisal Foundation decided to make uh, pandemics and vaccines the topic of this year's Prize in Medicine and I'm incredibly honored to be one of the co-laureates this year. Some of my friends and colleagues start congratulating me and that's when I realized I won the prize. I, I was really surprised. It's a wonderful surprise. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I'm really delighted and honored. I was actually skiing with my family uh, in Colorado uh, and uh, first my vice president of research called me and said, you, you won the King Faisal Prize because he had seen it on, on, on the web. And I, I thought he was kidding me. I was very excited, and, and obviously my family was very excited. So a lot of high-fiving. It's a really important prize, and a prize that uh, is uh, given to some of the most accomplished uh, scientists on Earth. And, and uh, it's just an incredible honor uh, to receive it.